Hello everyone. In this tutorial, we are going to talk about Catalon Studio. So Catalon Studio is free and powerful automation tool written on top of Selenium and APM. And as we all know that Selenium and APM is quite popular for the automation of web and mobile apps. And along with this, Catalon Studio have just blended one more feature to automate APIs, either it is written in SOAP or REST protocol. Here are few of the best feature about Catalon Studio. But before that, let's talk about why people like any automation tool. So as per my understanding, any automation tool that is going to help us to reduce the repetitive task execution effort. And second thing is how easy it is to install and start writing scripts. So in these two front, I think Catalon Studio have just won the battle because its installation is quite easy. The only thing you need to do is just download the Catalon Studio that is going to come into the .gif file, extract it and double click on the Catalon icon and you are ready to start using Catalon Studio. So this is quite simple to install and to run. The second thing is we don't need to download a separate ID either Eclipse or IntelliJ because Catalon Studio have already embedded Eclipse in its tool. So whenever we are just going to launch Catalon Studio in script mode, then we are directly working on the Eclipse. And here it is providing a facility to use Java or Groovy language. If you are comfortable to write your script in Java, then continue with Java. Otherwise, you can just use the Groovy and Groovy is quite popular now these days for the scripting purposes. And the third point is it is quite user friendly. Any naive user can just start creating and uh, can execute and maintain any of their scripts quite easily. And this Catalon Studio has been designed in such a way that any person with limited technical skill can start writing their automation script and it is quite easy to use. Now I'm just skipping this uh, point number four learning curve is short. We will be discussing it later on. The fifth point is reports. If we are talking about Selenium or APM automation, then what normally happens First, do a whole lot of homework to generate the report. Whatever the execution we normally do, we try to fetch some sort of report. And for that, we normally uh, remain dependent on various uh, XSLT related APIs. But here in Catalon Studio, reports are coming embedded. Every time you are just going to execute your test suit or a script, you are going to get a report. So this problem has been solved by Catalon Studio that most of the people were facing in Selenium automation. And along with this, it has also sorted out one more problem of logging of the actions. So here in Catalon Studio, we can just get every detail of every single step execution. And that is quite good in Catalon Studio. So we don't need to dependent on Log4j or some other logging APIs. And finally, the best thing is its integration with CI tool. Like suppose we are done with the automation with our Selenium script and we are able to generate report, then it is quite a big trial to integrate it with the CI tool. So here Catalon Studio have a very good interface to get integrated with Jenkins for continuous integration and continuous execution on a scheduled time. And along with this, we can also integrate Catalon Studio with Git 
and many other tools like Jira. So this is all about the Catalon Studio in short. In coming lectures, we will be going layer by layer to the Catalon Studio and we will be learning more. So thanks for watching.